Hi everybody, Grandma Bev here from Life with Grandma Bev. How are you all doing today? Well, Bob and I are rushing around trying to get everything together so we can take off Sunday morning. <laughs> Plus, we're nervous about Lucy because she had to be dropped off real early this morning at the vet's to be put under to get her teeth done and then maybe have some pulled. So we're nervous about about, you know, her having anesthetic because, you know, sometimes the animals don't make it, their little bodies and stuff. And Bob had to sign a thing saying that, you know, if if, uh, if, if she stops breathing or something, should they resuscitate her? Well, yeah. <laughs> it's not like, like they leave her hooked up to machines and feeding her through the tubes, you know, like a human, you know, <laughs> with a DNR. <laughs> But, of course, they'll charge $350 if they have to do that. It's like, I don't care how much. You can save that girl, you save her. <laughs> so, anyway, back to what <laughs> I'm doing. So, uh, that explains my appearance because we're just, we've been moving things in the back, getting stuff out of, out of the patio. The patio does not look the same anymore. Everything's put, you know, away because some of it comes with us to Yuma. <laughs> <So> <laughs> And now uh, the neighbor cats are freaking out. I mean, so far, Leia has shown up, thank God, because she didn't show up as much, and so we were able to say goodbye to her. Her sibling was out there, but that one hasn't warmed up to us yet, and the minute it sees us, it's gone. So uh, Leia was freaking out, looking around. You don't know, no, um, nothing out there. Where, where'd the chairs go? Where'd the carpet go? Where'd the lights? <laughs> and all of a sudden, at the front door, look who came, Stitch Fix. I was worried it wouldn't come in time before we left. And it's like, oh, what are we going to do? You know, because house that's time sensitive. You know, I got to get it back. So I'm stopping everything right now and doing it. So you'll see this. Well, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll post it today. I'm not sure. I'll wait till tomorrow. Because like I say, I've got I've to stretch out all my stuff so that you don't forget me. And I'll, you know, you'll, I'll pop up every so often. <laughs> So let's get started on Stitch Fix. First off, of course, here's my priority envelope. It's perfectly timed because I've got two packages I've got to get out in the mail. I was planning on getting it out tomorrow, so now this can go back to. <laughs> okay, and we have... Uh-oh, uh-oh, looks like winter stuff. Let's see, that's two. Oh, well, this is me stop you a minute while I uh let's see I can't see with these darn glasses on see what the thing go <laughs> hold on a second I might take a picture okay I'm back well let's get started the first bunch here looks like winter stuff which I definitely don't need I uh look <laughs> was looking on the, the site for the park we stay at and today we're like 80 something and Saturday's gonna be 91. So, you know, we don't need winter clothes. So here, this all looks interesting. I hope that it's, I mean, it's looking at it this way. Oh, nice. Let's hope it's not long sleeve. It's not, oh, okay. Well, I like this one. Look at that, it's kind of a, not, not maroon, kind of a, you can see it's kind of a purple. Not really purple either. <laughs> And luckily the sun is not shining in here yet, so you can see everything. So this is a pink clover made in Mexico. And uh, let's see what size is it? Extra large, okay, good. We'll see if it... Oh, shoot. Hand wash cold. I have a different person this time. <laughs> Hand wash cold, line dry. It's made out of uh, 54 poly, 42 rayon, 4% spandex. Well, I bet it could be done by gentle cycle in a bag. Now, this is definitely a knot to keep her. I don't even think I'll try it on. It's a, a nice sweater. <laughs> and it's also by Pink Clover, so let's see, it's knitted, so it's long sleeve, extra large, 
made in China. Same brand as the other one, but made in China. Well, it's weird the way the sides go down. Oh, I see. Hmm. Okay, and this one is 100% polyester. Dry clean only. <laughs> is it time to take a break from Stitch Fix? <laughs> Not gonna even try it on. And here's a pair of pants that I don't need. I mean, this whole outfit goes very nice together. I gotta say that. But I just, I don't, I don't need this kind of stuff. It's a democracy brand, size 16, ab solution, which must mean it takes care of your, your high-rise trouser. Featuring slimming panels constructed to mold and hold and boost your assets. Well, I don't have, I've got a wide part, that, <laughs> I, but I don't have a shape. A shapely butt at all. How oh, is this folded? <laughs> so, mm. Oh, so far we're striking out, kids. But that's good in a way. Because <laughs> I don't have to figure out what to keep, what to send back. Okay, here's some more. Okay. Okay, now this looks a little more like it. Look at this. I like v-neck short sleeve this is kind of a oh, tie-dye tie kind of thing. whoops there goes the box no lucy here to jump okay so this one is a market in spruce which is 95 brand five percent spandex extra large made in china Ninety-five rayon, five percent spandex, machine wash, cold, gentle cycle. That <laughs> so I will try that on. And then the last item, it's cute from what I see. I mean, look, look, look cute. <laughs> but I like it. <laughs> it's sleeveless. I let the pattern on, but look at the. Isn't that pretty? The the lace on it. The lace goes down the whole thing. Oh, can you see? Oh, I guess it's a, whole, a full button down. Oh, we'll see. I don't usually work with me because my, uh, my boob area makes them go. <laughs> so this is a Daniel Rain. It's size extra large, made in China. And it's sleeveless, and you know how I'm feeling about my arms. Lately, let's see, where's the tail? Here it is. 94 rayon, 6% spandex. Hand wash. Well, let's see. See what she said on the card. It doesn't say who's, who's from. It says, your style delivered. So it is a different person. How would I guess? Beverly, great to meet you and excited to style your 12th fix for you. Thank you for being such a loyal member of the Stitch Fix family. Let me know what you love or can't stand about the items in this fix. It's so helpful to better get to know you and your preferences. Changing seasons signifies also time for some closet updates and wardrobe changes too. During these cooler but not yet cold temps, it's cold here, but that's why we're taking off. Dip your toes in with warm fall colors and lighter weight pieces that will help you start making that transition. First up, the tan colored blend Capri pants. Those are Capris, huh? Great for warmer falls and winters. They'll look casual chic with the navy and black tee or dressed up with the elevated off-white Daniel Run tank. Look forward to hearing what you think about this fix or if there's anything you'd like in your next one. Enjoy your fix. Neil, N-E-I-L. Definitely a different person. Oh, I don't want to look at the prices yet. Well, okay, well, you know what that means. It's time to try them on. So, 
Sit tight. I'll be right back. Okay, here's the first one. I don't pay attention to these pants. Like I say, I'm in my, my sloppy whatevers while we're getting stuff together. I don't know if you can tell very well how it fits. I might try those other pants on just so you can see it with a better pair of pants. So, uh, you can see if I get closer. Bob likes it. Of course, Lou's not here to give her opinion, but let me try those other pants on. Okay, here we are with a different pair of pants. See, the sun's all over here on the floor. <laughs> Nobody puts Graham on the corner. <laughs> so that's how it looks, how it would look with regular pants. It's, uh, Bob likes the pants, but like I say, I don't, I, I wouldn't wear them. I've got pants just like them in the closet that I still haven't worn, so. Anyway, let's try on a different top. Okay. This is a cute top and I do like it. Bob doesn't like it as well as the first one. And a reminder, it is hand wash. And grandma doesn't do hand wash or dry clean. So let's try the next one. Okay. Sure is pretty, isn't it? Get up closer for you to see. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, it's big enough to where it's not, you know, and the buttons are well, they're pretty close, so. Boy, it sure is pretty, though. Getting ready to take off. Oh, I could get on my motorcycle. <laughs> okay, let's try the last one on. Okay, here's, before I could even get in the room, Bob was thinking, I don't like that one. <laughs> It's a sweater, guys. I wouldn't wear this. I mean, I'm already feeling, I mean, it's soft, but I can, it's annoying to me. You know, feeling the, material, the sweater material kind of stuff. So uh, let's move back to the couch and we'll go over everything. Woo, <laughs> and I am back. Oh, now it's, it's hot in here now. You know, because I'm all moving around like we've been doing. Whew. But yet it's cold outside, uh, 50 or so outside. So let's go over everything. <laughs> I've seen the prices. <gasps> Different stylist. Don't they pass the notes on? <laughs> okay, well, let's get started with this sweater, which is a definite no-no. Not only do I have no need for it, but my man didn't like it either. You know, I aim to please my man. <laughs> okay, and so that one, you know, it's, uh, it was called a, it's a pink clover, Nicole textured pullover in dark pink. Huh? I look at the right one. Yeah, <laughs> I wouldn't describe it that way. And that is $44. And let's do this one. This is another one that not only did, did uh, Bobby not like, I like it, but hand wash, not gonna happen. And so that's the other one. Let's see, that's a, that's a pink clover, Haley front pocket raglan sleeve. And they call that dark purple. <laughs> okay, $38. Price isn't bad. But... And okay, here's Bob's favorite. And I gotta admit, I really like it too. I just, I, just, I feel like I wear just a sweater with it, you know, hide my, my arms. And this one was, this one was a, a hand wash too, wasn't it? Let me see. Let me see. Hand wash. <sighs> I 
So that one was a Daniel Rain, which I can say Bob really liked, I really like, but it's hand wash, it's sleeveless, and it's $58 <laughs> for one top. Then the other thing Bob liked, <laughs> and I gotta admit, these pants are comfy. <laughs> And they feel like they fit nice. You know, I have a problem with the... Uh, I've got a broad butt, but I don't have a shape. <laughs> so, these uh, jeans I put on yesterday, I finally had to take them off. They kept slipping down. It was driving me nuts. So, I found an old pair with, you know pull up that <laughs> because the problem with those jeans I had on yesterday they didn't even have like belt loops where I could wear a belt to kind of help keep them up anyway so these were the democracy <laughs> they're called the Michelle Ab Solution Capri in tan $78 <laughs> and the last shirt, which I also liked, Bob liked it, but his favorite one was the, the sleeveless one. But you know, I'll get with it. Um, this one is twenty-eight. <laughs> my my price twenty-eight dollars. Machine wash, <laughs> put on the rack. Here I am slipping down here. <laughs> so, what'd you guys think? Now, I'm going to be putting this in the mail tomorrow, so if anybody has any comments or two cents or better make them tonight. I will post this this afternoon. So, the, the stylus picks subtotal came to 246 If I bought everything, which there's no way I am, I'd get 25% off, which would be... 61.50, so the subtotal would be 184.50, and shipping's free. And I'm a member of the Style Pass, where I don't pay a $20 styling fee every every month. So uh, let's see if there's any special offers on here. Not that I see. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. I'm just glad it came today, because this is Wednesday, and normally these always come on a Friday or Saturday, because I'm always complaining it's the weekend, <laughs> and I lose some days that way with the mail. So, okay, guys, comments below, share, I started to say fix, <laughs> share, like, subscribe, and I hope you're all having a good day, and not as hectic a one as I am. Tomorrow will be even, no, well, tomorrow I get this done finally again. And uh, hopefully we'll hear pretty soon about Lou. Uh, she was acting like such a nut last night, too. It's like she knew something was up. Anyway, I love you all. Bye.